아. 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 static stock and I wanted to put a sling on it but I never really had a um, provisions on it to mount the sling and other than on the uh, Magpul stock the webbing slots so I noticed online people are mount using paracord to mount their slings on some of their rifles and I thought that's a great idea further investigation I uh, found out that the uh, there's one sling actually being manufactured with it, uh, the Frank Proctor sling, which gave me an idea. So I figured, what the heck, I will uh, give it a shot. I got some paracord. I have this sling that I haven't been using. It's got the, um, I guess, the old AHK style clips. And uh, I'm going to give it a shot. I'm going to, um, I'll hack this up. I'll use some paracord and uh, we'll see how it works out. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to run the power cord right through the webbing. So I am going to remove this uh, receiver for the HK type clip that was originally on it. And then I am going to also remove this D ring. Let's do that. Okay. Well, let's try to pull this apart. Perfect. Garbage. One more. Hit. Yes, this plastic clips very easily. Two ends. Ready to go. Just sucked up a piece of power cord. So now I'm going to take a piece of paracord. It's about 25 inches long. I'm going to pull out the center strands. The braided outer will be strong enough to hold a sling. We'll discard those. And now we just have the braided piece. Still pretty solid. I like it. I'm going to take on end. We'll make sure the sling so that would be the rifle side of the sling. We'll loop it through. And just use a regular standard knot. I don't know if there's maybe a special knot that one could use, but I'm just gonna use a regular old fashioned knot so it kind of makes its own little cleat on the sling. Okay. We'll pull out the center strands, discard that, bring it through here, and then knot it. So now I have to tie some knots on the top ends. Oh, that's that. Then okay. 
there we have it. We'll trim these. Long ends and then we burn them off a bit. Same here, make a nice mess. Okay. Nice. Okay. Very good. Ooh, nicely formed. Nice. Now we'll mount it onto the rifle. Attach the sling onto the rifle. Rifle chamber is empty. I'll bring the paracord through the webbing slot. We want to make sure the sling is positioned correctly so this way when you loop it through there, it's sitting, well, it's oriented properly. Okay, so I'll show it up a little close. So now we'll attach the front part onto the rifle. It's going to loop around the, the front of the handguard. Okay, put that up. I'll bring that through. I'm going to this through here. Okay. Just going to attach this sling that I already had using the power cord and we'll see how it goes. So that slips on through there. Give it a nice little, little tight wedge. Yeah. So. Simple. Okay. Put this stuff back on here. We'll mount it up. We'll see how it goes, and uh, you know, maybe we'll get it out to the range. Okay. Rifle feels secure. Went on easy enough. Definitely feels pretty good. I like it. I can really kind of tighten down, tight hold on it. Okay, works for me. Let's bring this out to the range.